Hello and welcome. My name is Ben and I'm the director of Scholar and I'd like to introduce to you Scholar Regents Park. Scholar has been in existence since 1969. We are British Council accredited and we're members of English UK. And a few years ago, we received a Centre of Excellence for our summer programmes from the EL Gazette. I'd like to introduce where we're running our summer, junior summer centres this year. In Regents Park, we use the Regents University building. This is in the centre of Regents Park by the Inner Circle, by the Rose Gardens and the Lakes, and provides a perfect opportunity for your children to breathe in fresh air of the Royal Park, but also be very close to the sites and museums of central London. The location of the school is to the south of Regent's Park, near Madame Tussauds, if you know that well-known museum, and Baker Street is our nearest tube. So it's easy to get to Oxford Circus, uh, just at the bottom of the screen there, or if you want to live in St John's Wood, that's a fantastic place to, to live. Um, really, the, the location is the best thing about the school in terms of where it's setting and how easy it is to get into London, uh, whilst for the most of the day being uh, surrounded by trees <clears throat> and the green of Regent's Park, which we use a lot as part of our programme, whether it's for sports or the Friday party. This was our uh, programme this year. Uh, we did run a, a summer school in, in 2021 um, and next year we will run the similar program uh, for, for more students. We hope that more students will come um, and that the COVID restrictions will be much easier uh, and there'll be free travel uh, in June, July and August of 2022. As you can see, we've got uh, these huge 80 inch uh, TV screens in our uh, classrooms. They're touch screen. They allow the teacher to bring in a lot of media into the class. Um, there's 15 students in each class and so you can see that we bring students from all over the world uh, to London as well as they're already being students from different nationalities uh, resident in London or staying with their aunt or uncle um, for a period whilst they're with us. Uh, the program is English in the morning and uh, sports activities like art or drama um, and excursions in the afternoon. We also have a Friday party. Um, before that, every student will do a presentation in English, uh, and that might be the first time they've ever spoken in English to a group of people. It's a, it's a really great uh, play or presentation, and we've had science projects um, where students can share what they've done through the week and work towards uh, that final presentation. Uh, we hope the students will make friends with other students from all over the world. Um, and in a normal year, we'll have almost 50 nationalities in the school, which is a great way to learn English by making friends with students from those countries, but also to find out about different cultures and different points of view from all over the world. London really does attract uh, the whole world and you are able to engage uh, with them as a global citizen. Our feedback is generally very good. Um, we ask students uh, halfway through the first week and at the end of the course to make sure that there's anything, uh, there's nothing that needs to be fixed during the day. We do ask our parents, of course, at the end to leave Google reviews and kindly many do, uh, and also to, to point out where we can improve. Um, those are all fed back into the team to make sure that each year we're improving our program. And this is the schedule for next year. So this is the 2022 schedule. Um, it starts on the 20th of June and each week has a, a theme that links in the work that they do in the class with the excursions. Our six to nine year old group has an excursion on Wednesday afternoon and our 10 to 16 year old group have two excursions per week on a Tuesday and Thursday afternoon. On a Friday, everyone presents, and there's a party usually in the park. Um, and on Saturday, we do have an optional Discover England trip outside of London, uh, which uh, students aged 10 to 16 can join, as well as younger students, um, if they're accompanied by their parents. 
Uh, we run for eight weeks every summer and next year we'll finish on the, um, in 2022, we'll finish on the, the 13th of August. Uh, so you can really choose which week you want to come to and uh, decide perhaps your, your schedule whilst you're here to account for the trips that we'll be doing uh, with the students as well. This is the timetable. So we start classes at nine o'clock. Please arrive just before that. We finished at half past four every day. Uh, arrive at that time to pick up the students. Lunch is included in the full day program. Um, you can take a half day program if you want, which is just the English in the morning. And there's an option to add lunch to the half day program if you want as well. Um, and, and really everything's included. It's about 15 hours, it's 15 hours of English in the morning and about 15 hours of art, drama, sports and excursions in the afternoon program. Uh, and both the morning and the afternoon is split into two periods. So there's a break halfway through. And, and in all breaks, we offer uh, free fruit uh, for the students so that they can top up their energy le levels and get some good vitamins into their body. This is our price list uh, for next year. The most popular course is the five day full day course at 575. Um, there's also the six day course at 650 and the half day course at 375. And there's a 50 pound registration fee. So when you come to book, we ask for a 500 pound deposit, which includes the 50 pound registration fee. If for whatever reason uh, you need to change the dates, we can do that for free. If you need a refund, um, then we can refund the fees minus the registration fee. Uh, a visa letter can be provided for 25 pounds to help with any visa applications. And if two students or more are booking as part of a family, there's a hundred pound registration fee, which covers all of the registration requirements for that family. Parents are more than welcome to join us on the campus with the Regents University English Language Center. They run courses for 16 and over. Um, there's a 15 hour course or a 21 hour course at 300 and 390 respectively. Um, and that can all be booked through Scholar as well. Any homestay or transport um, and requirements can be booked through Scholar as well. So we can also for 10 to 16 year olds provide the complete package of airport transfers, transport to the school from a homestay and the course as well. To register, just go to the register button on the Scholar website. Um, agree to the terms and conditions and decide how you want to pay, whether in full or a deposit by credit card or by bank transfer. My details are here. I'm easily available through WhatsApp messages. That's usually the best way to contact um, me during the course. Uh, but by email is obviously the excellent way before to sort out any requirements that way. And finally, uh, we've been doing a lot of work online with one-to-one -one online English lessons. Uh, you can choose your teacher and book a trial um, either through the Scholar website or through the online lessons website, which also has tutors who teach maths and science and other subjects um, for a UK market, but you can access our teachers through there as well. Uh, lessons are about 15 or 16 pounds per lesson. For a 30 minute lesson, you can have 30, 45 or hour long lessons as well. Um, and as I say, you can choose your teacher and book a trial, a 20 minute trial for free uh, or for one pound on the online lessons portal and decide to maybe have one or two or three lessons a week, either before or after a course with us in the summer. So thank you for taking some time to get to know Scholar, uh, our junior summer centre in Regents Park and our online lessons. I look forward to communicating with you. Feel free to book a meeting with me um, on my calendar or you can email or WhatsApp me for any discussion. And I look forward to welcoming you and your family to London next summer. Thank you. <laughs>